They say he screams in his sleep, calling out for his father. Abbas, what a miserable man. It is not our place to judge. It certainly is. If our master has gone mad, I would like to know. Shh. Good evening. Water. Of course. Sit. Many thanks. What brings you here, old man? Pity, Abbas. Do not mock him. He has lived as an orphan for most of his life, shaped by his family's legacy. He is desperate for power, because he is powerless. He is our mentor, and unlike Al Mualim or Al Tahir, he never betrayed us. Nonsense. Al Tahir was no traitor. He was driven out, unjustly. Ugh. Is it... Is it you? I heard the rumors, but I did not believe them. I wonder if I might speak to Abbas myself. It's been... a long time. Impossible. Abbas uses rogue Fedayin to keep us from the castle. Fewer than half the fighters here are true assassins. So, where do I begin? With us. You say these men are cruel. Has anyone raised his blade against an innocent? Alas, yes. Brutality seems to be their sole joy. Then they will die, for they have compromised the order. But those who still live by the creed must be spared. You can trust in us. You heard the story from the town of the village? About the birth in his nightmare? No, no. al <laughs> What about? People say that they will save the life of the <laughs> They say he fought with a hidden blade. Ah, rumors. I don't believe it. True or not, say nothing to Abbas. He is sick with paranoia. You make me ill. Assassins! To me! Mentor. Welcome. Shh. We do not want to get him killed. Kill the traitors! Nothing. Nothing. You pathetic miser. Follow me to the castle. And spill no blood if you can help it. Oh, 
Altair, <sighs> two decades have passed since we last saw you within these walls. We could use your wisdom. Now more than ever. For you fools, he has bewitched you. Our mentor has returned. My respect, mentor. I fight for you, for the order. Welcome, Hunter. Welcome back, man. Try and die! Always an honor. Die! Together for victory, Mentor. Welcome back, Mentor. Mentor. Tell your men to stand down! No! I am defending Masyaf! Would you not do the same? You corrupted everything we stand for and lost everything we gained. All of it sacrificed on the altar of your own spite. And you! You have wasted your life, staring into that apple, dreaming of your own glory. That is true, Abbas. I learned many things from the apple. Of life and death, of the past and the future. Let me show you. I can never forgive you, Altair. The lies you told about my family, my father, the humiliation I suffered. They were not lies, Abbas. I was ten years old when your father came to see me. He was in tears, begging to be forgiven for betraying my family. Then he cut his own throat. I watched his life ebb away at my feet. I will never forget that image. No. But he was not a coward, Abbas. He reclaimed his honor. I hope there is another life after this one. Then I will see him and know the truth of his final days. And when it is your time, we will find you. And then there will be no doubts. <laughs> <laughs>